Hey, what's up guys? It's Matt. We are in Minecraft. Oh my god. We were at the staircase to nowhere, apparently. Uh, somebody with a sign in my house, and I, this isn't my doing, but it's probably Flamey Tigwas or Cuddly Heavies, who knows. But yes, we are in Minecraft. This is the first episode, uh, basically a little rundown of what's going on in this series. And we're inside my house right now, which is kind of empty. But we'll get to that in just a second. I want to let you guys know a couple things. Uh, when I spoke to you guys before, I was letting you know that I had a really cool project going for Minecraft, for a series. And I was trying to integrate two different genres into one. Well, I'm still doing that, but I've had a snag in one of the integration parts, and that would be a problem. So we're not really doing what I wanted to do, but we are going to continue along with the with the series because I need to get some videos out and I need to start making some videos in this world because I'm progressing more than I, sh I thought I was going to so we're having to start you know a little early and that's okay uh, if you guys have been watching some of my streams I've been doing here on YouTube and on twitch.tv yes I am back on twitch.tv for all the people that are annoyed with the live comments on YouTube I now have it over on Twitch you can go over there, I do it random times, I'll do scheduled ones, and you guys can chat with me live in IRC. So that's taken care of, but sidetracked, back on topic, Minecraft series, here we go. Uh, we are in a custom server, and I consider this to be called Minecraft++. And the reason I call this Minecraft++ is for a couple reasons. The first one is... I wanted to go back to playing vanilla Minecraft because it was becoming uh, feature rich. More things were happening in the world and additions were being put in that mods were having to uh, be required for. And so now you don't need the mods, you can just play vanilla Minecraft. Uh, Redstone updates and all this other stuff. It's really cool. So I thought that, but then I'm like, I like some of the mods still. So why don't I just add a couple things instead of trying to play Feed the Beast? Which seems to be the flavor of the month and everybody's doing it. And they're like, oh my god, play, play, play it, play, play it. And I can't. I, I just don't want to do it. I played Tech It. I got bored of Tech It because it became too easy to get everything. And I played, what do we play? Terra Firmer Craft. And then we played Thomcraft. Uh, and Thomcraft was just, I don't know. I just lost interest in all that stuff. So... What we're doing is this server, and there's a couple people on it right now. Flamey Tig was on this server, and it is whitelisted, so no, it's not public server. And the Cuddly Heavy as well. And the reason I have Cuddly Heavy on here is because he's a dedicated viewer, and he's helped out on quite a few things, and uh, he's a, he's a good guy. And so I invited him to come on here and you know hang out and help out with some thing with some things. So we're gonna be doing that, and uh, so yeah. We're doing uh, three different mods, and I can go over those really, really quick. Oh my god, I'm down some stairs. Holy crap. Uh, we'll get to those signs in a second. We're doing three things. We're doing build craft, we're doing rail craft, and we're doing forestry. That is it. Everything else is vanilla. So there's no uh, MFSUs uh, through industrial craft, and there's no... Uh, portals or crazy magic wizard stuff or or whatever you want to call it uh, all that other crazy nonsense so we're not doing any of that um so down here I've, I've already started a little bit and i wanted to do this because i didn't want to go hey guys we're gonna start minecraft let's punch a tree no that's that's not how it works in this series it's not going to be every little bitty thing You'll see update videos, you'll see major events, things like that. We'll do stuff together. I'll get your suggestions on what you want to see or ideas on builds, and we'll do them. Uh, it's not going to be like, hey, we're going to cut these trees down and we're going to run around and look for something. That's boring. I don't want to do that. So I've been playing this, and I'm trying to stream it as I can uh, when I'm on. And somebody's got a sign down here. What is this? Mr. Chicken. Oh, there's that's... Uh, that's Nugget, by the way. We named... Whoa. Alright. Appreciate you. 
Uh, we named him Nugget in the stream a, a couple days ago when I was trying to get animals, which we'll go look at in a second. So anyway, really quick, this is the basement area which we had cut out. Uh, Flamey Tugwa helped me set up a filler that would destroy all the blocks. And we got this all uh, cut out, and I've got some coal coke ovens over here, which you see i got some creosote oil already. I've got six of them total, which is what I'm going to start with as a base. And we're going to go down here really quick, and I'll show you the XP farm. We managed to find a zombie spawner right here by the house, which was it was mind-boggling how it was, it was right there. But anyway, this is just a simple XP farm and item farm for zombies. You can hear them over there going, blah, blah, blah. Uh, It's just a drop tower. Nothing nothing special. It's off right now. They can't really go through it. Um, but since I'm near it, they're going to spawn anyway. So we go back up the ladder. And there's not much here right now. I had a quarry where you can see this cobblestone. And I just wanted to test the quarry and make sure it worked. And then I used a filler to fill it all back in with cobblestone. Because we're going to make use of this space uh, very, very soon. And if you notice when I was up there, there's some holes on top of the ovens, which I'll show you in just a second. These holes are going to be used for part of a railcraft uh, system that we're going to have. And it's a railway with minecarts that are coming here, and they'll dispense coal into these ovens automatically so the oven can uh, turn into coal coke. And then under that, there will be an item something. I don't know what it's called. Where another rail system will pick all the coal, coke up, and go deposit it wherever it needs to go. Uh, these are a couple of little simple machines that I made uh, with the help of Flamey Tigua. It's a carpenter uh, machine and a thermionic fabricator because we're all futuristic. And I put them down here nice and neat, try to tidy up a little bit. And this is my chest room. Uh, I've got some signs to indicate what goes where, all that. I'm still building it out. I don't have things in every single chest. There's still things missing, and, and the stuff's not completely full. I like There's like three things in here of soul sand, because I hate the nether, and it's uh, it's like the worst thing ever. So uh, I do have a bunch of nether racks, since it's easy to get, and I have a bunch of nether bricks, which we're going to be doing soon, 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 soon. Um, I don't have any diamonds. I use them all. I have a quarry, and I have my awesome pickaxe, uh, pickaxe of godliness. Fortune 2, Efficiency 2, and Unbreaking 3. That thing should last me a while unless I die to some stupidity, which I did earlier when I was off stream and off uh, not recording. I happened to have all my stuff out of my inventory, and I was AFK outside, and it turned dark, and a zombie ate my face. But anyway, we're not going to discuss that. Uh, back up here on the first floor is... It was going to be the crafting area, but I don't really know what to do with it since I made all these furnaces. And that's, that's pretty much it. I mean, I was like, yes, furnaces, this looks awesome. And then I had all this other space I didn't know what to do with. So there's a crafting table, a, ch a chest, and an anvil. That's about it. And an infant water pool, but, you yeah, know, whatever. Uh, my bedroom is right here uh, with the awesome bed. And then an empty room. So we're going to step out here really quick. And holy crap, it's a quarry. Uh, well, what's going to be a quarry? It's not really on right now because I ran out of coal and stuff to 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 run these engines, so it's off at the moment. And I put some trees down here just for the heck of it. I kept running out of wood. Uh, if you were watching the stream the other day, I didn't have any wood, and it kept <laughs> it kept driving me nuts. So uh, I've planted a whole bunch of trees all the way around, and I'll harvest them and then replant them, so on and so forth. But uh, this used to be just an open area, <clears throat> excuse me, an open area, and I decided I was going to flatten it all out and use it for all of the farming stations that's going to be part of forestry. And I'm like, no, I don't want to just waste this if there's ore and stuff down inside uh, this area. So I'm going to quarry it all out, and then I'm going to take a filler and put back all the dirt and the sand and the gravel and the cobblestone and fill it all back up, and then we'll work on decorating and laying out uh, plots and stuff like that. So let's jump into creative really quick, just to give you an overview of the area. And it's almost a 64 by 64 quarry, but I made it a little smaller uh, than the max just to, I don't know, I didn't really need a 64 by 64, so things are spawning, we don't really care. But anyway, here's the house. It's a modular style, nothing special. 
typical home, you know, whatever. There's nothing amazing to it. Um, these are my water collection tanks, which they are... They should already be full. Yeah, they're already full. They're going to be part of Railcraft, and they're just like little water towers. I tried to decorate them a bit. Uh, they did look kind of stupid, and on the stream last night, we redid all four of them and made it look a little prettier. So we don't have pipes hooked up to them just yet because we don't need them. Uh, the zombie grinder uh, tower comes up out of the ground, and I just made it a little decorative thing there. Nothing too amazing yet. And the typical animals, and apparently the pigs are gone. And there's a sign here that says sheep, I guess. For whatever reason. I don't know. Somebody keeps coming over here and putting signs up all over the place. Who, I guess, is a, a flamey tiger, and that's okay. But my, my pigs are all gone. I don't know what happened. I don't know if they ate each other or what, but... Uh, the sheep are still chilling. The chickens are not as many. I had a chicken militia, but uh, maybe they each ate each other too. I'm not really sure. Then we got cows, the usual cows. Flamey had to bring over another cow because I only found one, and we managed to breed some of them. So we're going to do something with these. I don't know what just yet, but uh, we'll figure that out in a later episode. This one's just to let you guys know we're starting. We are starting. We're going to go ahead and kick this sucker off and get some building done and get some stuff going. We're not going to go to Flamey's area right now. If you were in the streams uh, the past couple times, you probably saw it. A lot's changed over there. We're not really going to go over there right now. But in the next couple episodes, we're going to have to take a trip over there anyway to use some of the stuff that he's got. And I think we're going to have to go to the swamp biome that he's got over there too and get some more slime balls. So, with that said, uh, this is what we got, guys. This is what we're going to be doing. Um, try to bear with me as I you know, continue to prep the areas and come up with new builds and, and things to do. Um, there's plenty to do right now because we don't really have anything. We don't have steam engines. We don't have a boiler. We don't have a uh, blast furnace or anything like that. Let me get out of creative because we don't want to be in creative. Uh, things like that. So, anyway, I'm going to probably be streaming quite a bit as I play. Because if I'm going to be playing, I'm probably going to stream it while I play. And you guys can just hang out uh, and watch it later if you want, and so on and so forth. I do need to know from you guys in the comments, though, what you want to do about streaming. A lot of you have mixed feelings about YouTube streaming, and a lot of you have mixed feelings about Twitch. You'd rather have it all on YouTube, and some of you would rather have it all on Twitch uh, for streaming because the chat and communication is a lot easier. Well, that is completely true, and I'm going to be testing some things this week, uh, probably tonight after I get done recording this. You guys won't even know about this until <laughs> after the video goes up. But I'm going to stream to both YouTube and Twitch.tv at the same time. So if you don't want to deal with the live comments, you can go watch it on Twitch. It's the same stream and chat with me live. Now, if you don't care about Twitch, you don't need, want to make an account or all that hassle, and you already have a YouTube account or a Google account, you can stay on YouTube and, and hang out or whatever and leave comments and all that fun stuff. Um, I'm not asking you to go to Twitch and I'm not asking you to stay on YouTube, anything like that. Uh, you have the choice and I'm trying to accommodate everyone accordingly. So, with that said, the Flamey Tiger was here. So was the spider who died a couple days ago. I killed him. He, I was going to keep him. And really happy, smiley face, Flamey Tiger. Okay, bye.